what's his name? Ryan Winther. That guy had some ass in that shot. Hey, what's up, boys and girls? Man Bear back with another video. Hope you guys are having a really good day. And as a lot of you know already, big Sasquatch, Isaac Sanchez is coming back to golf. He's been hitting a thousand balls a week. He's getting in really good shape. Actually, he's been a vegan since January, so he's looking really good. So today we wanted to go out and film a little bit and um, <clears throat> I actually brought him a driver to use. He, he had built a driver for himself and you know, according to um, the specs and what he should be, what he should be hitting, but he just wasn't hitting very good. So I wanted to have him hit one of my drivers, which as most of you guys know, long drivers are like the standard for testing. If a long driver can hit it, and I'm talking about a good long driver, not your uh, weekend warrior at the driving range, but um, if a good long driver, their drivers are perfect. They're balanced perfect, they're weighted perfect. They use the best drivers in the world. In this case, I use a crank driver. I've been using a crank driver for 11 years since I started long drive. Obviously, I've, I, tr I tried other drivers like Bang and Mutant, both really, really good heads. Um, it's just crank is what I'm most comfortable hitting with. I won my world championships, set all my records with it. So I know my drivers are built perfect. So we're gonna head out to the range. Sasquatch is gonna take you a, a run through of how he gets ready, what his driver setup's like how he's hitting mine. So it's gonna be, you guys take some notes, it's gonna be pretty cool. So uh, we're gonna head up to Emerald Lakes and uh, shout it out to Isaac. So we're out here, um, you know, just come back to golf. You know, I, when I left the golf world, I had access to all the coolest things and all the great equipment. And I think sometimes I might've fell in love a little bit with launch monitor numbers and and what you're supposed to be hitting. And we're out here at Emerald Lakes Golf Club. I'm hitting Man Bear's driver. It's a four degree crank driven golf driver. And it's got some kind of Kevlar Patterson shaft. And on paper, the driver I'm hitting probably is what, you know, your average golf shop would fit you with, you know? It's kind of what I built for myself based on the numbers I was thinking I was at. And I'm out here and I'm hitting this four degree driver with a shaft that doesn't really make sense. There's probably not a club fitter in the world that would put me in this, but it's taking off straighter, it's curving less, and carrying probably 20 yards farther than the driver I'm hitting. So I guess my point is don't fall in love with what they say you're supposed to hit or just numbers are like, this is your perfect setup. You want this length driver, you want this loft, you want this shaft. Um, the shot tells all. If it's going where you're looking and it feels good, um, it's definitely at least equally as important as what the numbers say. So if you're listening, Lance, 